Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Solinux Crypto. Hope you're all doing great and welcome to this uh, new video on Tensor. All right, wanted to give you my thoughts in general. Um, wanted to do a full technical update, which I mean, it launched yesterday evening. So we're looking at a 15 minute time frame for so 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 for the traders and the and the technical analysts uh, under us. I know that's uh, not that much to go off of. All right, I, I normally never use the 15 minute time frame. Um, or, or in general, I, I don't really try to do technical analysis on new coins like these. However, I have found that with crypto, with these new cryptos, um, the 15 minute time frame analysis actually can help. <laughs> All right. So, uh, so that's what we'll do. Uh, in general, if you are interested in Tensor and you want to know about it and you want to know my, my general game plan, uh, go to my videos. Check out my last video I uploaded. It's not the last video anymore when you watch this video, but overall it's, it's this video. And watch that, all right? I do a full, 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 full analysis, full review in there. Uh, quite valuable, I would say, if you want to learn more about the project. Now, in general, to start off, I'm actually quite bullish on, on Tensor right here. Uh, because what we're seeing is that the, the project, look, I, I have my doubts about the project and the, and the viability it has long term. But the market cap right now is $240 million. It's a new Solana launch, which some of them have actually performed very well. And the volume is $1.16 billion. And that is one of the most interesting things that I that I found find interesting about Tensor, uh, because that's insane, all right? So, so that's, I would actually say that if you look at all the last launches on Solana, but also in general, uh, $240 million in the market cap is actually quite low. So I think Tentra has a lot of potential. Now, we will talk a little bit about the fundamentals. We'll, we'll mostly talk about the technical, so don't worry. But um, I have to say that they also do have some, some major backing, right? So they have backing, for example, uh, by the co-founder of, of Solana, by Solana Ventures in, in, in general, and some other VCs. Um, that's all pretty bullish. So I would say purely technically, look, there, there's not much of a structure. There's a bit of an uptrend over the course of uh, over the course of this morning, as you can see. But what I'm waiting for, I think that if you look at the the, the price right now, the main resistance level is this level right here, around two dollars and two dollars and five cents, which is also the zero point three eight two fib of this entire move down. So that's the main level I'm watching, and um, ultimately, what I what I expect, what I think is most likely is that we will just get into some sort of a consolidation right here between 2.05 and, well, let's say 1.75 or, or like 1.65. That's what I think is most likely because usually when a crypto just launches, it will get into some sort of a consolidation like that. But the main level I'm watching is 2.05, all right? And that's the level that if we break above that, I uh, have to serious, seriously consider buying. You can also see if you look at the open interest right here, it's growing and growing, right? So this is not necessarily bullish per se, but $30 million in open positions in a matter of, uh, well, what is it? Seven plus, in, in a matter of 18 hours. It's quite a lot of money, quite a, quite a lot of eyeballs on this, quite a lot of strong backers. So most likely, and what you should expect is that we'll just kind of consolidate here and bounce around. But what you should keep your eyes on is $2 and 2.05 cents. If we can break above that, I think ultimately, but like like if we break above that and, and really hold it right so it's a real breakout i think ultimately we can we can aim for 2.5 and, and filling the wick right here at 2.65 so that's quite a lot of potential right so if, if you then take a trade like this um on the on, on the retest of 2.05 or, or two dollars even if you aim for like 2.45 and you set your stop loss under the 50 ema that's still a good risk reward um, so very interesting in my eyes. That's what you need to know for now. Those are my thoughts. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. Quickly resetting my camera at the end. Uh, for now, have a great day and, uh, and bye.